Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you my Easter decor for my chalkboard area. And I'm gonna just show you what I did to uh, transition from spring to kind of, well, I guess it's kind of spring, but going into Easter um, and just to show you what I did and how I got to this point. And uh, yeah, I, overall I like it. I think it turned out really cute. I'm always picky with this specific, uh, the chalkboard, because I'm not very good at writing, but I always find uh, um, inspiration from Pinterest and try to just do my best. But overall, I think it's cute. I incorporated decor from last year and this year that I found, and uh, hopefully you will enjoy the video. And I also put a couple pieces on my dining table, which I will show as well. So hopefully you enjoy the video, guys. I, I have a lot of fun doing this specific area as Derek made this chalkboard for me a couple years ago, and it's been really great for implementing different uh, decor changes throughout the year for seasonal and holidays. That way I don't have to do all of my home throughout the year because it just gets to be a lot of work. But this is a central part of my home since it is in the kitchen. Uh, it just makes for a fun way to just add a little bit of change uh, throughout the year. And I always like to share that with you. So thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you find some inspiration to do your own Easter, Easter decor if you do that, or just to enjoy what I've done of course on a budget and uh, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video guys bye so time to clean up this area kind of get uh, rid of the spring type although I will go back to something similar when Easter is done and I'm just taking everything off all my little magnets those magnets I actually made and then I'm just cleaning off my chalkboard this works really well it still you know has a chalky residue but I just want to make sure it's as clean as possible now I gotta dust it off make sure it's all clean and I just uh, actually was adding these uh, larger eggs that I got at Winners and then I incorporated some smaller ones and then some flowers just to kind of you know add a little bit of height and I just think it looks very uh, eastery in spring light and I'm adding my little banner that I got as well I just think it's really pretty I love this uh, banner it's so darn cute so here's the trickiest part for me guys is trying to do the writing so Pinterest really helps me with this so I do try to do my best to make it look presentable and that's all you can do so here is my finished chalkboard area I think it looks really cute I tried to draw a little bunny with his bum sticking out through a hole in some uh, tree I used my magnets for his tail and then used my color chalk to do his little feet and then the, the writing I used a few different colors and the banner I got from Real Deals last year as well as Tall Vase is from there and then the glittery um, bow is from the dollar store the carrots and the crater from Michaels there's my DIY mason jar that I made and then my Easter sign from Dollarama and the cute little owl is from Real Deals so this I think looks really cute and I overall think it looks really nice and looks great when you're walking into my kitchen door this Easter sign like look at all the little wooden the bunny the carrot the little egg and my sensi this thing is just seriously my serious new obsession I love it and just love the little eggs and look at my cute dining room table there's another DIY mason jar I did I added the cute little bunny chalkboard label thing I got from Dollarama today and what about Mr. Ceramic Bunny he is so cute. I love him so much with the little ceramic basket that I put my little jube jubes. So I got all of that from Dollarama. Guys, I really think it's adorable. Easter is one of my favorites to just decorate because it's just so feels like spring is coming. You use so many different colors. It just, you know, it makes you feel happy and Easter is just such a nice blessed holiday really what the reason of it is although I do it more with bunnies and whatnot so thank you so much for watching guys I really hope you enjoyed this video and everything that I did to decorate for Easter please leave me any questions or comments below I appreciate you watching and I will see you in the next video guys